FCA's partnership with Waymo continues to grow as 500 Chrysler Pacifica hybrid minivans will be added to the expanding self-driving program. This is in addition to the 100 minivans that FCA already delivered in 2016. The news comes in conjunction with Waymo's announcement that select residents in the Phoenix area will have the opportunity to experience the self-driving Chrysler Pacifica hybrid minivans for the first time. To learn more about this early rider program, visit waymo.com slash apply. Now, when it comes to a Chrysler Pacifica that you can drive today, the 2017 model lineup has a new addition. The 2017 Chrysler Pacifica Touring Plus fits in between the Touring and Touring L trim models and features premium fascia, power lift gate, three zone automatic temperature control, upgraded interior lighting, and more. Chrysler Pacifica Touring Plus is in dealer showrooms now with a starting MSRP of $32,360. Well, you know, when you look at the minivan segment and you look at how families use the, uh, the Pacifica, we took a step back and said, what's the next generation of people movers and family haulers and, and what are families want? And they really wanted simplicity. And that's the great thing about this vehicle. It's not a matter of taking the batteries and forcing them into a vehicle where they don't fit. We had the perfect application to put them in the stow and go tubs in the second row. And it's right where you want them. It's in the middle of the vehicle, low center of gravity, great for driving dynamics, and it gives families a 30 mile all electric range, which they can't get anywhere else in the market with a seven passenger vehicle capable of carrying their family and all their gear with them. So one of the key things we learned about a hybrid customer, and that is um, they, they want to drive an electric mode as much as possible and they also want to coach. They want to be coached on how to drive the vehicle more efficiently. We really wanted to take advantage of the 8.4 inch radio screen as well as the seven inch screen in the cluster, the driver information screen. So we developed a couple screens. We have a, a coat efficiency coach, uh, we have a charge power screen, and we also have a power flow screen uh, as well as um, a driver history screen in the uh, and the radio, and most importantly, we have a, a charge scheduling screen. The E-Flight electrically variable transmission is the heart of the hybrid powertrain. Uh, it consists of two electric motors, a planetary gear set, and a one-way clutch. And the one-way clutch is kind of the biggest innovation we've put into the transmission, and what that allows us to do is drive the wheels electrically with both motors. For the Pedestar engine, we did a couple of modifications. The first thing we did was uh, put in new camshafts and also new valves as well as new pistons. And what we did that for was is we increased the compression ratio, which increased the mechanical efficiency of the engine, uh, as well as uh, changing the valve events, which uh, reduced the pumping losses in the engine, also making it more efficient. So. In normal vehicles, um, they have friction brakes. So when you stop a, a vehicle with normal friction brakes, all of that kinetic energy is converted to heat, and it's heat at the rotors and at the brake pads, so it's lost. With a regenerative braking system, that kinetic energy actually is converted to electricity by using the electric motor inside the transmission. The average family drives less than 30 miles a day, so the, the fact that we can put a 16 kilowatt hour battery in the Pacifica that qualifies for the full $7,500 tax credit would provide families the ability to go all week with never having to uh, go to the gas station or use any gas. But the great thing is, is that on the weekends, forget the cord, forget uh, the electric range, and you can drive to uh, Florida and back because you have a 16 gallon fuel tank and a V6 under the hood. So this is uh, what we believe is a game changer in the market.